It's a project years in the making to upgrade the airport in our state's capital and make way for more passengers. But the project has seen some challenges. News 13's Marilyn Upchurch explains what's taking so long. Santa Fe, we deserve a better airport. Construction began in February last year on the $22 million worth of upgrades at the Santa Fe Regional Airport. It was supposed to be done this past January, but now the estimate is December of this year. On top of supply chain issues and staffing shortages, workers ran into some other problems. When you start digging, you start finding things. So uh, in the parking lot area, uh, once we dug up the old parking area, um, we found a lot of abandoned um, utility lines um, that were not supposed to be there. Airport manager James Harris says the first phase will add 700 parking spaces, a new terminal, and revamp the taxiway. Currently, the airport's one terminal accommodates around 360 passengers across seven flights a day. Harris says the second terminal will accommodate more flights for the two existing airlines and possibly make way for another. We got to grow for the future. Right now, we're boarding um, full flights and as the airlines try to add more flights, we have to grow with those flights. The project's second phase will expand the terminal, adding up to five gates and more seating. Though Harris acknowledges the construction can be inconvenient, he says it won't affect their services. I just like to tell people just understand that we're under construction, so things aren't ideal right now, but we're working to make it better, and we're hoping that we don't have any more delays and we can continue operating properly. Marilyn Upchurch, CareQE News 13. Funding for the project comes from city, state, and federal money.